Okay, I understand you had some things to say on the, uh, the House floor today about a certain basketball game. I did. I uh, wanted everybody to be uh, revved up for the game this weekend between the University of Memphis, the number one team in the nation, and the number two team, Tennessee. And uh, I hope that uh, my team, number one, University of Memphis, wins that game. Now, when you played, <clears throat> would you ever have such a big game like this? Uh, we had some games big, but nothing this big. I don't think we've had this big a game in the whole state of Tennessee uh, that I can remember even going back into high school or possibly in the nation. Now, uh, you got a tie there that uh, I, I think those are Memphis colors. Uh, there, that, that blue looks a little bit like Michigan to me. Well, uh, the blue is part of the Memphis colors. Uh, the gold may not be. We've had some other gold uniforms trimmed years past, but uh, I tried to wear at least something blue today uh, to support the Tigers in this game. Now, if there is such a, I know it's hard to speculate, but if there were a, a, perhaps a loss suffered by the Tigers, my understanding there's something about wearing orings that you might have to, uh, uh, you know, add to your wardrobe on Monday or Wednesday. If, if, if we do lose, which we're, I don't, we're not, yeah, I will have to uh, unfortunately succumb to uh, wearing a, uh, a pair of orange pants, but and we win. Uh, the, my other colleague will be wearing my college basketball jersey into the chamber and a University of Memphis hat with some blue pants. That is Representative Armstrong from Knoxville. <laughs> Anything else you'd like? agree to just a friendly wager. No, I, I think it, for the, 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 this game and the economic impact on the state will be tremendous. Uh, they've got folks, folks coming in and news media around the world, somewhere around the world just to, just to see this game. And, uh, it's one of the biggest games I can ever recall. Uh, there's only three times in the history of basketball that the number one and two teams played each other from the same state, and that was, I think, Duke in North Carolina, Cincinnati in Ohio, and now Tennessee and Memphis. And uh, You obviously were a guard. I did play guard back in my time. Did you shoot a lot? I could shoot a lot, yeah. I could shoot a lot, yeah. We just didn't have the three-point shot when I played, so. But, uh, but uh, uh, it's going to be great for Tennessee. It, it, it's, you got two Tennessee teams, uh, you know, right, right up there. So just the publicity that we get in the whole state of Tennessee from the east to the west, and from Johnson City to the river, is going to be uh, tremendous. It really is.